Okay, here's a quick intro to the SFTP program we're using in Visual Studio Code. Uh, this is SFTP by Naughty Z Skunk. Um, and it's, once it's enabled, um, all you need to do is open a folder. Okay, then I select the folder once I've created it and it will open up this. Then you hit Control Shift P and you type SFTP. Once you've done it once, it'll already show up, but SFTP colon config, um, and that will create an SFTP folder file for you. And then you can get your FTP information from your server. Now this default file does not have passwords, so you have to add password colon and then paste it in. Uh, and then add a comma at the end to get the other one to work. Everything else should be fine because we're on Cloudways. We, uh, the remote path is always public HTML. And then you, when you save that, um, we will get a, we have an SCFTP icon here now that we've created this config file. And when you create it, you have this Portland chimney Inc folder. And when you click on that, it will try to connect. And if there's any problems, then it won't open up. But because we have the files here, this is now the remote view. These are all the files on the server. And this icon is all the files on your local server, on your local computer. So you can, um, the one quirk about this one that I haven't figured out um, is when you go into a theme and you want to download a file or to edit, if you just double click on it, it will open it, but you won't be able to edit it. So you'd have to right click edit in local, and then it will download and now be editable. And that's it. Enjoy.